Water levels around the Waterloo region have the Grand River Conservation Authority asking residents to take extra caution around the river. So far, the GRCA have issued flood warnings for the Speed River in Cambridge and the Grand River in West Mount Rose. Communication manager for the GRCA, Dave Schultz, tells 570 News what we can expect in the next few days. The good news is we didn't get any rain overnight. Uh, there had been some rain in the forecast, so we're starting to see river levels kind of hold even or drop a little bit. However, there is more rain in the forecast for tonight, so we'll see some peaks again on Friday. But uh, what we're seeing, what we'll see on Friday and Saturday, is peaks that are all a little bit lower than what we've already seen. So uh, we're still going to have high water, and there will still be some areas affected, but we're going to see a gradual decrease in, in the coming few days. Schultz adds, although the levels aren't at record highs, residents still need to be careful. The river is still running many, many times above what uh, is normal, and we're still going to have some road closures in different parts of the watershed, and the banks and areas are still going to be very dangerous places. With the rain not dying down anytime soon, Schultz explains what areas are being affected the worst. Well, mostly it's a lot of, in most places what we're seeing is a lot of fields, and low-lying areas around rivers affected and some roads that travel through those areas. So mostly it's just been road closures, uh, not much effect on uh, property, on homes yet. Reporting from Cambridge, Christine Clark, 570 News.